Listen. I understand that there's a lot of fans of this show. I understand that Kerry Washington is a very, very talented actress. She looks mighty fine, too, on top of that. I understand all that. But this show and other shows on TV like it don't really put black women in the greatest of light. And somebody needs to say something about it. I mean, it's Black History Month, so of course this video has to take place. You understand what I'm trying to say? Now, why do black women like the show Scandal so much? One black woman came up to me. She was like, you know, I like the show because it just puts black women in, in, a, in a role of, you know, men just lust after her and, and want her for more than just her body, but her intellect and her stature and her power, her mind power. Okay, that's good, well, and dandy. But at the end of the day, she's known from the perspective of people that's watching the show as a concubine. She's the concubine of the President of the United States of America. The plot line of the show is a little bit of the on a you know a little bit on the mission impossible side. If I you know, just saying. All right, I've watched the show. All right, I can't do a video like this if I haven't watched the show. All right, I watched this show before I watch any of that you know Housewives of Atlanta or you know uh, uh, Love and Hip Hop of Atlanta. I, I watched this show before I watched that show. All right, because the show is actually good, but the plot line is a little impossible, if you ask me. But just the misrepresentation of what black women are is not concerning to any of these women out here. Now they'll sit there and they'll say, "Oh, this is just this is the reality show, man. You know, just just chill out, man. Just just chill out." Nah, man, no. Hollywood's perception of what black women is, man, is it should be insulting. I mean, you know, I could post links, you know, I could post articles, but that's what YouTube is for. That's what Google is for. Why do the work for you when you can do the work yourself? But don't know, I mean, but, but black women don't have a problem with this show. They don't have a problem with world star hip hop. They don't have a problem with, you know, bad girls club. They don't have a problem with none of these shows. They actually look forward to seeing these shows every week. They don't have a problem with none of it, man. They don't. Black men don't have a problem either because they just too they too busy trying to get the cheeks. So they're just gonna look past the fact that these chicks out here are putting themselves out there like whores. You know what I'm saying? Because they just want to get the cheeks, man. I'm a guy, so of course I of course I know, right? I mean it's it's ran through my brain. But the difference between me and the other guys is is that I see the underlining meaning. And even though those guys, I'm not saying that those guys probably won't understand the underlining meaning. It's just that they don't care about the underlining meaning enough to the point say, all right, well, my underlining meaning, you know what I'm saying, upholds my standards. And my standards are held, you know, on a solid foundation. And their standards aren't held on a solid foundation. So they'll let their standards, you know, they'll put their standards completely to the side because they want to smash a chick that looks like this acts like this, walks like this, talks like this, puts themselves out there like this. That's what guys do. Every guy has somewhat of the same standards. But their standards are built on foundation. And if their foundation isn't strong enough, then you're going to have guys that are probably going to watch this video and try to defend this this behavior that you see on World Star Hip Hop, that you see on Bad Girls Club. The representation of this woman, uh, uh, um, Kerry Washington in the show they'll defend it but they won't list the fact though and in this video I'm going to list facts not just opinions I'm going to list facts that are undisputable so I want these people to understand that yeah this is a TV show but where's the outrage man where's the outrage People just love this show. They love it. I actually, I, I love, I'm going to tell you like this. I actually like parts of the show. I really do. Like I said, the plot line of the show, 
It's a little bit on the Mission Impossible side. That's just the way it is. But nobody has a problem with this show. The women, black women, don't have a problem with this show at all. They'll they'll stop what they're doing. I, I think I, I think I heard about somebody getting beat up because somebody interrupted an episode of Scandal. Like what? Huh? Or some chick posted something online about oh don't do no you know Barack Obama State of the Union because it's going to interrupt um um Scandal. Like what? Like a show a show about you know a woman being a concubine is more important than the President of the United States saying what he got to say. Basically, at this point, but nobody sees, nobody has a problem with this. Nobody has a problem with the first thing that you think about when you think about black women at this time of point, and this is a fact right now. First thing that you think about when you think about black women is how many children that they got, are they in school or not, how big is her butt, and is her and is her hair real? Those are the three things that the typical black man will think about. When it comes to, to to black women right now in 2014, all right. Don't believe me. Don't believe me. Go up to go up to about five to ten different guys and ask them. All right. Now they won't say exactly what I said because, like I said, these guys don't have foundation. And the ones that do have foundation will say it in they'll, they'll say it in a way in which. You know, it'll come off like it's not what they're trying to say, but that's exactly what they mean. And in many ways, it's just like I can't, I can't blame these sisters out here for liking this show. Because this is all, this is what they've been portrayed as the whole time. Every, every single, every single place that you go on the internet, it's a twerk video. It's chicks with tattoos on their chests. There's manly looking females out there. I think that that's the reason why people like, you know, Kerry Washington's role on this show. Is because her character is a, is a manly portrayal of a female. It's, it's, it's not really a feminine, you know, portrayal of what a female is. I think that, I think that mainly because, and like I said, the seven minutes into the video... Some plus minutes into the video, the main reason why black women like the show Scandal is because it puts them in a position of power. A position of being lusted for or lusted after. Steve Harvey wrote a book called, and I think that they did a movie spinoff of it, Think Like a Man, Act Like a Woman. Or act like a woman, think like a man. It's one of the two. Uh, I apologize for not getting the title right the first time or the last time. But that concept has been running wild. And there's nothing wrong with that concept. You know what I'm saying? Because in order to make it out here, you got to kind of, you know, be aggressive like a man. And not, you know, really hold back on your ambitions. You can't be soft and gentle about everything but the defeminization which is I think I'm gonna tell you like this that's probably a brand new word the de the defeminization well, let me say it one more time the defeminization <laughs> I'm having fun with this the de femin forget it y'all know what I'm trying to say the women black women out here are just not feminine all right at all that's the reason why this show right here, Scandal, that's why they like this show. Because Kerry Washington's character is portrayed as, in their mind, a strong black woman. And in the minds of, you know, people that actually see the underlining meaning, let's get back to that, the underlining meaning of this, is that this woman, you know, might be in a very, very feminine body, but her actions are manly. That's basically what it is at the end of the day. That's the reason why black women like Scandal so much. Because it does give a, a realistic visual of what black women are in 2014. Unfeminized. 
I'm making up a whole bunch of words in this video. <laughs> I said I was listing facts, but hey, just forget the fact forget the fact that I'm making up words along the way. You guys understand what I'm trying to say. So if you watched this video, if you watched all 10, 11 minutes of this video, just go ahead and drop a like. If you don't like what I got to say, okay, so what? So what? Most of the most of the things that I said in this video were opinion. But the fact still remains. Here's the fact that I said I was going to list. Here's the fact that I'm still going to uh, that I'm going to list. Hollywood doesn't think too highly of black women. That's a fact. And like I said, Google and YouTube is at your disposal. And that's the WC. I'm the WC man. This video is over. I'll see you guys next time.